Hello all, Scotty here and welcome to Let's Play Stranded Deep. This is a game that was recommended to me recently, so I thought I might as well give it a try. The game itself is on Steam Early Access, so it's nowhere near finished, but I thought I might as well give it a try anyway. So without further ado, let's jump straight in. Okie dokie, loading. <gasps> Okay, so we've got more or less kind of like the forest kind of beginning. Can I move? Oh, oh god, yes, I can move. What does that say? Share. Shark claims another victim. Okie dokie. So rather than a commercial airliner this time, we are on a private jet. Can I see the. I can't enter the cockpit, sadly. And stuff is falling apart. Okie dokie, let's make a martini. So, craftable objects are highlighted in orange. I kind of missed that. Open your inventory to select your lighter. Okay, now I can drink the on fire martini. Yay! All crafting and building co um, combinations in the stranded deep are constructed in the physical system. Head back to your seat to enjoy the flight. Okie dokie. Oh god! Oh, okay! Right, that wasn't completely unexpected, but then again, crashing horribly is bad. <laughs> Okie dokie, so I'm guessing we're gonna crash somewhere due to the giant hole in the side of the plane. Oh god. Okay. Uh, this is bad. Get to the life raft on the surface. Okay. I will get to the life raft on the surface. Alrighty then. This is rather loud by the way. I should have really turned the game down. Can I turn it down? No. I could not press escape for some reason. But that is definitely loud for me. Explosions, I guess. Yep. It exploded. I'm gonna. I apologise for that. I'm gonna adjust my sound. I'm sorry if you couldn't hear me. Oh, okay. So can I just? Uh, no, I can't adjust my sound settings. Fair enough. I guess I don't exactly need to. So, ooh, let's go to the fir the island first, if I can. See if there's anything on it. Now I've no idea if food or water is a factor yet. I do know there was a demo which you had to try and like stay alive as long as you could. Okay. I don't think I'm meant to be able to do that. <laughs> okay, okay. Early access game, why not? Ooh. I need you, Rock. I want you. So what else have I got? Found the crab. Let's kill a few crabs. Get a little bit of food. There we go. Alrighty then. Oh god, what is it? oh. I'm now a floating a floating knife. Okay, so is there anything on this island really? It look like it. But then again, we have to, to survive. So how do I craft? How on earth am I meant to actually craft something together? Do I drag it? How do I drop something? Oh, how do I drop something? Can I drop something? I'm pressing all of the buttons. Well, that makes me crouch, but I can't appear to drop the item. I've just got this rock in my hand. Okie dokie, so I'm guessing that's kind of pointless having that in my hand. If I could just press the right button, there we go. A small female crab. I've got a lighter. I've got a pocket knife. Oh, okay, that worked. So what was that? What did that just drop? Lashing? Okay. 
Okay, so can I actually drop this, I guess? Maybe. I'm guessing I can go and explore the other islands. I'm not 100% sure how I'm going to craft something, but I can definitely pick up items for crafting. Got three rocks. Right, let's head over to one of the islands that we can see in the distance. Not before picking up the stick. Now, this is the first time I have launched the game up, so if I'm completely missing something, uh, feel free to let me know. Feel free to tell me where I'm horribly going wrong, because I can't quite work out how to craft. Where's my raft gone? Oh, there it is. I'm going to head to the island over in the distance. There's a starfish there, but I can't get the starfish. Let's go! Forward! Oh no, we're stuck! Mayday! There we go. So I'm guessing we're on like a small peninsula, I think that's what it would be called. Oh no, an archipelago. A group of islands. As we make our way across. So I hope I do learn, like, work out how to craft something. It's not urgent at the moment because I don't even think I have any kind of um, hunger bar at the moment or any kind of energy bar. Uh, so I might just be free to explore. This game literally came out a couple of days ago. Uh, so this might just be more of a tech demo showing what they are capable of doing. So I'm, I'll probably do a fair few videos on this as I make my way across the uh, unforgiving sea. Or at least it's getting closer. I'm not on a road to nowhere here. Okay. Yep, so I'm officially in the middle of nowhere here. And I've, have I gone to the island that's the furthest away? I think I have, you know. Oh well. I think that's slightly closer. Oh no. <laughs> I don't know if you guys can see that. But it looks like we've got company. No no. No no. No 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 no. Oh shit. Go! Go! No Sharky, no! Sharky, no Sharking! Not that far away now, you just need to keep going. Sort of. Oh, hello boy! Have you got anything? Is there a boy? Does, a, does that mean there's civilization nearby? Because boys usually mark something. Unless it's just an old fishing boy, which it may well be. Do you have anything, boy? Or are you just marking nothing? You have nothing. Okay, okay. This is further away than I thought. Okay. I guess it's like several miles, which is why it puts you closer somewhere at first. But it's quite a trek, but it's getting closer by looks. Now I do, in as I say, I do enjoy playing games like this. I'm gonna see while I'm while I'm in the middle of nowhere. I'm gonna see if I can craft anything. So that does nothing. Do I hold G? So if I really, really wanted to, I could set that on fire. Ooh, what's that over there? I can see something. And there's another shark there. Not quite sure if he's going to do anything or if he's just chilling. That's the boy. No. Sharky, no. I 
I don't want to end up in the water because then the sharky will eat me. Which won't be very good for my health. Come on, Scotty. Yes! It's getting closer. It suddenly changed into a giant island from a small distance island. So we're making progress now. Maybe there'll be some more things. Or maybe I won't get eaten by a shark. Evilly trying to kill me. Oh god, no. Don't want to fall off. No. That is the last thing I want to do. Some very fish over there. It's slowly generating whatever the hell it is over there. Now I have got my uh, draw distance set on high, but I'm guessing it's just like a, a randomly generated map, so it's putting the items in as I get closer. Which isn't too bad. A little reef there. Okay, okay, we're now on the island. Is this any different to the other island? Probably not. Ooh, that was a long dis distance track. Okay, there's some more sticks over here that I have no idea what I'm supposed to do with. And let's continue to uh, paddle ourselves forward. <laughs> Ooh, there's a ship. Alrighty then. Can I get onto the ship? I can't. Oh god. No, uh, no, uh, no. Uh, uh, okay. How do I, how do I, how do I put you away? How do I? So I've got a water bottle. I've no idea how to empty my items. One, two. Oh, I've taken some damage as well. To my, uh... Oops, what the fuck? No! How do I do that? Um, shit. What? I guess I pressed tilde. Um, um, whoops. Okay, um, I will be back in a second because I've accidentally pressed something and opened the developer's console and I've no idea how to close it. So, I'll be back in a moment. Okay, we're back. So I have no idea what the hell I pressed to get the developer menu up, but I managed to get it closed uh, by saving the game and relaunching it. So I'm going to see if I can explore the crafting system now. I've got a fair amount of items that I can now use. Uh, if I can select the stick and then drop it by pressing the Q button, maybe it'll give me an option or two uh, to actually do things. They're all craftable. So if I drag you over here, and I drag you over here, like that, can I, use, can I make something with you? I can't. But maybe if I place the lashing on the ground, this is kind of reminding me of Tug now. I don't know if you guys have seen me play Tug. No, don't you dare run away, you sodding lashing you. If I can grab you and put you over here and then if I go back into my inventory and get one of my sticks out and do this yes lashing crudax there we go that's the crudax being made and I can pick it up and I can probably chop down a tree or not okay those, those trees aren't choppable palm tree I can chop you, which is good. What the hell are you doing? You're growing. Okay. So the trunk is ready. So I guess I just need to chop the chunk into bits and it will eventually come off. There we go. That's, that's actually quite a good concept. You have to actually... Does this do anything? Like, 
can I make more out of this? Does it just become smaller and smaller and smaller? Yeah, it becomes sticks. That makes com actually makes complete sense. It's more of a, a more of a complete crafting system to what I've seen in the past. And like the forest has the same kind of concept, uh, but you don't have to do it in this kind of way. So can I just carry this? I'm carrying this using the right button, by the way. For these guys that are curious. So how can I make fire? How can I think about setting something on fire? It's getting dark. Oh no. Coconut! I guess I can eat the coconuts, which will be good for my health. Keep picking you up. Can I carry this? Yeah, I can carry this entire chunk. Take it out of the water. Wee. There we go. I'm guessing. Can I use. Maybe I'll be able to use the top bit as like tinder. Uh, because it, I'll be able to dry it out and then burn it, which will be would be interesting to do if it'll let me. Log. That's not a log. Now, as I did mention, I have no prior information on this game, so I'm going to be learning. Ah, uh, hello, palm tree font. So, what happens if I drop the palm tree fonts on the ground here? A great deal of nothing. Can I light them? No, I can't light them. There isn't anything like simple fire. There isn't much in terms of the menu. Let's try and drag a few things out here. See if I can just set them on fire. Nope. It appears that I can't. Can I eat the coconut? I'm guessing if I hit them enough, I'll be able to get the nutrients on the inside. Yeah, drinkable coconut. All the trouble is about coconut, I think it actually dehydrates you. It's getting dark, and I, I have no idea how to make a fire. Um, panic, panic. Um, okay. So I've got a light. I have got a lighter. But I've no idea what I can actually use it on. Doesn't actually give me much I much information. But at least I can light my way around, which isn't too bad. I'm kind of stuck as to what to actually do though. Palm tree font useful for crafting and building. Uh, can I actually kind of, like lash something together? Like if I do this. And then put the lashings together? No. That doesn't work. And it's dark. Oh, the, the moon's coming up. And it's travelling very quickly. So I'm guessing at this stage, I don't actually have to worry about much. It is a very early access game. Uh, this is more, more of a concept than anything. But it, there is an achievement to make fire. Why can't I make fire? Maybe I need to chop it some more. Okay. Let's drop the crowds because they're, they're evil and they keep making me sick. So I'll put them there for now. I'm going to try and work out how the hell... That looks quite nice, by the way. That looks very nice. I don't know how well you guys can see, but it's good job it's a full moon, because I can actually see what I'm doing now. So let's pick up the lashing. Actually, let's just move it. Hmm. So the lashing's here. Where did I put the rest of the... Uh, I've lost where I... Oh, there it is. I lost where I put the palm fond, or the hell, how the hell you call it. The hell is that noise? No idea. Okay, so I can't really do anything with that. I 
can't do a great deal with the so I'm stuck in terms of crafting as I did mention this game has been out basically less than 48 hours from me playing this uh, I've jumped in completely blind maybe if I just like line up look if I have like, loads of sticks can I use it to make a fire let's have a look I'm guessing I can kind of make a basic fire. Stick. What's that? Campfire! That's brilliant, that is. I'm guessing I can just light it. Yay! That's better. Now, can I cook these guys? Can I cook you? Yeah! Uh huh. Can I pick you up? Why can't I pick you up? Oh, wrong button. Hmm. Maybe I can pick that up, place it over. And then I can put the crab here. No, it kind of chucks it. It still chucks it. Yeah, I just need to kind of move it rather than chucking it. Yeah, that makes sense. It's cooking now. Crabalicious. I'm not sure if it's going to change into cooked crab. Well, at least I've got some kind of fire going now. Which is good for me. So, the... I have to get, like, a few logs that can be piled on top of each other uh, to make a basic fire, which is quite simple. I could probably add to it if I have to, but it, it might be fine. I could always relight it if I, ha if I need to. So, now I can probably eat these crabs without risk of infection. Oh, yay! Raw crab for me. Oh no, it's still infected me. That's not good. That is very, very bad. Let's chop up, chop up a few more logs. Takes its time, but it's worth it. Chopping wood, chopping wood. Okay, I can make my oops, I can make my campfires, but I don't really want to yet. Maybe if I get a few logs together, it'll give me a different option. Chop a few, chop a few growing palm trees down. The fuck? I realise why I'm getting that noise now. I don't know if you guys saw that, but there's a shark fin. A shark is a shark is currently swimming underneath the island. If that makes any sense to you, a shark is swimming under the island. You see, did you? I don't know if you guys saw that. But yeah, there's definitely a shark under the island. Okay, can I drag this? Yeah, I can. I can move it. That's good. You don't have to cut it so far away. Now, as a test, I'm going to try cutting all this up. Like, cutting all the chunks up and see if it gives me another option to craft. And that'll probably be it for this video because I've been recording for a while now. I ho! God damn it! God damn sand shark! Why? 
Why must you be such a sand shark? So that's the log. Let's chop the rest up. I ho, I ho, it's off to work we go. I ho, I ho. Oh, oh, missed. I missed my, I missed my, uh, my swing. So maybe I can make a basic shelter in some way. That's still a chunk. Alright, so let's try and move all these together. Let's see what option it gives me. Not a great deal. No options yet. So what if I just chop all of these into logs? If I chop sorry, if I chop all of these into sticks. Maybe it'll give me an option to more build options, because it'll kind of have more than what I've ever had before. Let's just chop all these up as a test. I'm just kind of screwing around with the crafting system right now. I don't think I'm under any kind of pressure right now to survive, really. Um, by the looks of things, at least. Okay. Campfire! No! Oops. I don't want a campfire yet. So all of those logs for a campfire, no. What now? Campfire! Fuck. Oh, it's getting lighter. Okay, so is it just going to say campfire again? I guess so, like, I'm just going to be able to make an infinite amount of campfires for no reason. But oh well. Oops. Left click. Campfire! Yay! I can make some more campfire even though I don't want to. Okay. I think on that note, I'm going to stop recording for now. Uh, it's a very interesting concept game. I'm probably going to continue playing it. Uh, I'm just going to see if I can work out the uh, crafting system a little bit more. Uh, try and maybe get a, be a uh, basic structure up. But it has got a lot of promise. I'll include a link in the description for you guys to get a try for yourself. I think it's only like 11 quid uh, in British, uh, British monies. Uh, so it's worth a go. Uh, the general reviews from other people has been very positive, who have played the game a lot more than me, even though it's only just come out. Uh, so, if you guys want to see some more, feel free to let me know. But, that's all from me for now. See ya!